Hi everybody. My name is Timothy Trespass and I am a targeted individual. Um, as it pops into my mind, I have two places on my back. Back, back, on my back. Uh, right, can you show this? Right above, right above where you can reach. Just, just like this far above from where you can reach this way or this way or that way or that way. One on each side of the spine, above the lumbars. Right above where you can reach. And it feels like uh, two spots, two places, two things, two implants that uh, they make hurt. Sometimes it's one side that hurts. Sometimes it's the other side that hurts. Sometimes it's both sides that hurt. Uh, and they can make this horrible itching that spreads throughout your back and you can't reach it. It's the perfect place to put an implant. We've been knocked unconscious so many times with their sleeping gas and them coming into the room and they do anything they want to us, you know? Uh, but that's one of the things that hurts. And, and you can tell it's like not a physical thing. It's not related to something in my body that's happening that I'm doing. It's, External, um, just as another thing as I mentioned it, smoking cigarettes in New York City parks is now illegal. I didn't know that. And of course, since the policeman's job is to carry out a commercial transaction with me uh, on behalf of the city, whether I want to transact or not, as a statutory citizen, I get a ticket. And I have to tell you, I was so afraid yesterday. You know, I mean, just having police contact when you're out on recognizance, on your own personal recognizance, is enough to get you locked up again, if they're assholes. Um, I don't know, I guess nothing popped up on the, on the pop-up a later machine when they ran my name, but. You know, I mean, how, how much bad luck, right, can one person have? It was almost like somebody called them on me and said, yeah, we got a bum smoking crack in the park or something, because the way they came over was like, like I was going to shoot them or something, you know? I was exercising, stretching out, you know, I was in pain, and I had a cigarette in my hand. Because I had just gotten over the panic attack. And I'll tell you, these guys gave me a panic attack, for real. And poor Petra is right now in the bowels of justice, uh, fighting off this ticket that they gave her for possession of residue, uh, which, you know, again, they could have said, hey, you know you can't smoke here, don't do it again and we'll give you a ticket. But that's not what their job is. Their job is to make money. So, um, the same thing with Petra. They could have said, hey, tell your boyfriend, your husband, to come down to the police station because he has an active complaint against him and when we see him, we'll arrest him. But no, they didn't tell me that either. It was like all a big surprise waiting to happen. I really don't like living in a Nazi country. And what's worse is I live in a Nazi country that has technology that uh, most people don't believe is real and they're testing it out on everybody that's my story and I'm sticking to it thanks for listening God bless y'all